do 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 Hey guys, Vincent Jallo here, just uh, tidying up the old video room. Making sure everything's in the proper spot, you know, making sure the staff put everything away last night. Uh, and everything's looking good here. But uh, today we're going to do, do a review on a couple of, uh, basically some creepy Halloween music for you guys. Uh, some of my favorites. Uh, I've got a large collection of, uh, you know, vinyl uh, Halloween records from back in the 70s and stuff. And the 80s, the stuff we listened to as kids. But today I'm going to focus on a couple more modern ones that I really, really enjoy. And, uh, you know, we'll go through that, sort of show you guys what that's all about. And uh, we'll see you guys Check it off. First off, guys, this here, this came out in 1998. This is Rob Zombie's Zombie Gogo -Go Records release, Halloween Hootenanny. Now, if you do not have this, you need to go and get this. This, I've listened to this, well, it's t for 20 years. It's unbelievable. And, um, whoops. Okay, we don't need that in there. But there's the uh, the inside there, guys. Check that out. There's a little insert in here, and you know, little little uh, little things in there, as you can see here. We got. Jeez, guys, sorry about that. Here we go. Look at this. There's all the different bands. So basically, it's a it's a compilation. All right, compilation of these great great bands. Uh, there's actually some uh, Zachary mixed in, a couple songs with him. If you remember him, the old uh, horror host from back, way back in the day. But uh, this thing is, is really great. It's a collection of, you know, garage rock, uh, you know, garage surf, surf music, kind of, um, maybe rock, you know, rockabilly kind of mixed in there too. These are some of the bands that are on there, guys. Reverend Horton Heat, The Bomboras, Southern Culture on the Skids, Satan's Pilgrims, Frenchie, Rocket from the Crypt, The Amazing Crowns, Swing and Neckbreakers, Lost Straight Jackets, Zach Relief featuring Southern Culture on the Skids, The Born Losers, Deadbolt, The Ghastly Ones from Canada, Dead Elvi, Davy Allen and the Phantom Surfers, The Legendary Invisible Men, and another one by Zach Relief. Guys, Pick this up. This is like the greatest thing to throw on at a Halloween party. I listen to this thing over and over and over and over. Like I said, I've been listening to this for about 20 years. And uh, it's terrific. Uh, Rob Zombie did a hell of a job on that. Uh, really cool. Oh, real, real, real quick here, guys. Sorry about this. But uh, I meant to say in another video, check this out. I'm a big, just a little side side trip here. I'm a big black exploitation fan. And we'll review some black exploitation in the future, but. Um, Rob Zombie was selling a bunch of his old tapes, and I managed to get my hands on Now, he had a lot of, you know, monster stuff and that and stuff that, you know, I like those movies, but, you know, I'm more of a slasher guy, not so much the monster guy. Um, so, but he had this one black exploitation film, and I'm like, this, this belonged to Rob Zombie. I gotta have this in the collection. How cool is this? So here's his uh, copy of Dolomite that I, I managed to pick up. Uh, in great shape. Doesn't look like he finished watching the whole thing. Shame on you, Rob. But, uh... There it is. So yeah, I keep that up on the collection there. Kind of cool to decide to sprinkle that in since we're talking a little bit about Rob Zombie. All right, next. Now, if you can't track down the Halloween Hootenanny, it's, it's, you know, it's been out for 20 years. You can still get it on CD, but you know, it's a used copy and it's fairly expensive. And Rob Zombie released this on vinyl. Every year at Halloween, you know, September, October, I try, you know, I try to find this, see if you've released it or see, you know, see if there's any news. Sorry about this. Uh, to see if we can get this on vinyl. You need to release this on vinyl on like a double, like a two LP, you know, uh, deluxe set or something. Because that album is, is hands down fantastic. Some of the greatest Halloween rock and roll music, uh, you know, it's just, it's fabulous. But if you can't find that, guys, I believe you can pick this up on Amazon. Mondo Zombie Boogaloo. Now on this one, okay, it's by Yep Rock Records. You've got three different bands on here. The Flesh Tones, Southern Culture on the Skids, and Lost Straight Jackets. So again, Garage Surf, think, uh, you know, maybe a little Rockabilly mixed in. Basically, you know, Garage Band kind of, you know, Halloween stuff. Terrific. There's the back, guys. And this comes on two records. Um, so it's a double LP. I mean, it's a regular length, but it's stretched over two LPs for better sound quality. Uh, I'll just give you a little taster of this, so... There's the uh, the covers there, the, uh, the slip covers, if you will, the uh, for for the uh, for the records. I would pick this up as well, guys. I, like I, I, I listened to this in Halloween Hootenanny 
all the time. Uh, I'll be playing it later today. Every year, it's, it's terrific. Uh, the last one I was going to talk about, guys, was also this one here. Southern Culture on the Skids. Zombified. Now again, if you're not familiar with the uh, Southern Culture on the Skids, oh, I run into problems here, guys. Um, again, American Southern rock mixed in with, you know, maybe a little rockabilly, garagey kind of sounds. Pretty eclectic stuff. Uh, really, really good though, this one here. These are all sort of Halloween themed songs. I would definitely pick this up as well, guys, if you can find it. Um, and you know, if you can't get it on vinyl, who cares? Get the CD, right? So, lucky for you guys, I've got these as well on a CD, so you can take a quick peek at that. You know, pick these up, guys. I mean, this is this is really, really good listening. Like, you throw this on, like, everybody enjoys this. It's great. You know, it's not like listening to Ghostbusters and Thriller and Werewolf in London, all these songs we hear all the time, all these parties and stuff. You put this on, this is real music. People get into it. It's awesome. So check that out, guys. There's little interior shots there. Uh, the Southern Culture one is giving me problems here today, guys. Uh, very cool, you know, very cool stuff. So check those out, guys. Give those a listen. And uh, last but not least, I want to show you one quick thing here. Just a little shout-out to Sven Gulli. If you don't watch Sven Gulli, or, Sven Gulli or know who the hell he is, he's a horror host out of Chicago, and he's been on for years now. There was an original Sven Gulli, and then there's like this, this Sven Gulli's been going for 20-some years, you know, the current guy. He's on every Saturday night at 8 o'clock, on me TV, shout out to that. Uh, but you know, he, he just plays these old monster movies and you know, Dracula and Frankenstein and Dracula meets Frankenstein and you know, and the Wolfman and uh, you know, just all kinds of stuff. Uh, Creature from the Black Lagoon, all the classics, but also a lot of the more obscure stuff. Uh, like, uh, you know, just recently watched Ants and um, Tarantula Deadly Cargo and Tarantula. And just the list goes on and on. Really, really cool. So, you know, you know, in between, you know, coming in and out of commercials, he's there doing little skits and stuff. And one of the skits that he had one time was with uh, Freddie Boom Boom Cannon here. They did a song called The Sven Gulli Stomp. So I managed to pick this up. Really, really cool. Just a neat little collectible, but a great little song. Uh, you know, so if you watch Sven Gulli at all, you'll probably see this at some point uh, pop up on the show. And, uh, yeah, just uh, if you haven't checked out Sven Gulli, check him out as well. So, guys... Halloween Hoot Nanny. Right? Mondo Zombie Boogaloo and Zombified by Southern Culture and the Skids. Check these out, guys. And like I said, we'll do a review on some of the other records and stuff I have, but I just wanted to kind of get that out of the way today and show you guys some of the stuff that I listen to this time of year. It's really good stuff. Check it out. Please leave a comment below. Thumbs up if you can, and make sure you guys subscribe. I really do appreciate it. And we'll talk to you guys uh, probably next time for another VHS slash a review or something like that. Talk to you guys soon. Take care now. Bye.